Hey guys, Tech Pro here. Now today I'm going to be looking at the PS3 Slim and Light. Now there's not much change in the specs, but it is does look a bit different. As you can see, I've got a post up and running on the website. It has been rumored around for a very long time, and as in my previous video on YouTube that I uploaded the night uh, a few hours ago, about 12 hours ago, uh, it's deleted now. It looked a lot different. The rumored pictures looked a lot different to what it looks like. So this is how it's going to look. Uh, it's not going to have a gloss finish, which is not really a nice thing to me. I have the uh, fat PS3, the old one. Well, it's still... It's the three-year-old one. I've got that, the original PS3. Now, I am a fan of that. It's glossy and it looks good. Uh, I have no complaints about it. A small PS3, I guess, it's small and sexy, I guess, but is it that much better than the old one? Do you really see the need in having it? Yes, it's going to be $100 cheaper. Now, that is a lot better, but what do you think's better? Now, the specs really haven't changed at all. So we're still seeing 1080p coming out of it. Or the Bluetooth, or the wireless, um, a bigger hard drive. So we've got 120 gigs now. Um, we've still got the same capabilities, so as the old one. So uh, there's not much of a big difference, which is good. So they're not actually cutting anything out. Now it's a great Blu-ray player too, because it's updatable. It's always being updated. Sony, that's why I like about Sony. Sony are always updating their um, firmware. So that's what we talk about when we're about a Blu-ray player. Now for $300 US, now that is a pretty great price because a Blu-ray player will cost you about up to 150 and then that's not even with a hard drive. So we've got a hard drive in this so we can install out our movie files onto it. Which is pretty cool too. Now the new um I'll show you this. It's called Play TV, which will turn your PlayStation into a DVR. So we plug it in to the wall, then we plug it into the USB, and it's got two HD tuners in it so that we can record to the PlayStation and watch at the same time or record two shows on the fly. So that's pretty neat. It, it looks pretty good too. The, it's got a full capable guide and this is what the box will probably look at like. It, it's been rumoured around for a long time. It's, it is um, official but it still hasn't come out yet. I don't know if they haven't got it right yet but I think it might be out in a couple of countries. I'm not too sure. So yeah, that's a quick look at the new PlayStation 3. Let's see your thoughts. Log on to the blog. It's the first blog at the very first page, so enjoy.